the practice of digital india an overview of digital india program the digital india program undertaken by the indian government has multiple objectives number 1 universal access to mobile connectivity this initiative aims to ensure mobile connectivity in all parts of the country by 2018 the objective is to provide each citizen of the country with access to mobile networks and associated services there are number of services offered by different departments of government and other basic services such as banking insurance etc where the mobile number of the resident acts as the authentication for ensuring reliability of services hence access to mobile network is essential and therefore mobile connectivity is being established number 2 public internet access program this program aims to improve connectivity within the country it is intended to build common service centers in each gram panchayat and also converting post offices into multi service centers the cscs would provide citizens with centers from where they can access multiple services like utility bill payments exam records land records etc post offices will be converted into multi service centers to provide not only postal services but also financial services such as savings and insurance the third objective is building broadband highways it is a program building internet connectivity across the country it is the essential and first step towards building digital india services all that services that will be available as per digital india would require good connectivity and across the country broadband highways is the basic connectivity to all citizens this initiative focuses on establishing connectivity all over the country as part of the initiative 250000 gram panchayats are planned to be covered under national optical fiber network nofn by december 2016 another initiative is the building of national informatic infrastructure which will provide high speed internet connectivity to government departments by accessing the network and cloud infrastructure and the next objective is e kranti it is the most crucial uh, initiative of digital india it provides services such as e health technology for justice e education etc e health care would cover online medical consultation online medical records online medicine medicine supply pan india exchange for patient information medical records of patients including multimedia data like ct scan x ray and mris will be stored and accessed from a single point of access the next objective is e education is the project that aims at developing massive open online courses mooc that can be leveraged for education and provide citizen access to huge amounts of knowledge along with forum for student and teachers to debate discuss and form meaningful conversations the next one is e governance it aims at making the best use of growing technology to provide services like banking civil services postal services and more to every citizen of the country irrespective of their location it is not commercially feasible to open physical branches of banks and full government services everywhere in india because of it, it is a, a very vast country and widespread one hence to provide equal services to all citizens of the country e governance is planned to be implemented e governance is one of the nine pillars of digital india it uses pervasive nature of it as a platform and government intends to reach every far corner of the country and provide the services like voter id aadhar number integration of services and more information all is the next objective this initiative is aimed at making the documents imperishable pervasive and immune to theft and loss while assuring the authenticity of the documents the next objective is early harvest programs this is the initiative that contains multiple services like national portal for lost and found children koya paya biometric scanners in all government offices mass messaging applications for government employees a messaging application will be created for elected representatives and government employees with the intent to create a forum for discussion generate a fast response and share ideas through a two way communication between representatives and employees the last one is it for jobs plans to train students from various villages small towns tier 1 tier 2 and tier 3 cities so that they can become competent enough to take up it jobs 
in the next five years created by Digital India project.